Fortnite Island and experience creators, get ready to revolutionize your island designs with a deep dive into UEF and its latest features. To access the new devices, go to the content browser and within the Fortnite folder, go to devices and open the new early access folder. In this folder, you'll find the fixed point camera device, the fixed angle camera device, and the third person controls device. Let's talk about the fixed point camera device. The fixed point cameras maintain a predetermined location and angle throughout gameplay or in specific areas. These cameras adjust dynamically to player actions, but can also remain completely still, capturing a specific view of the game environment. You can use multiple fixed point cameras positioned strategically throughout the level in any game, creating a similar effect used in early PS1 and 2 horror games such as Resident Evil, Dino Crisis, Alone in the Dark, and many others. Unlike the fixed angle camera, the fixed point camera needs to be placed in a specific location where you want the player's view to focus on a specific object, character, or area. You can use the device options to specify if the camera stays still, or if it can rotate up and down, or turn left and right, in order to keep a target in frame. Many of the device options are the same as the fixed angle camera, and the same rules apply. However, the fixed point camera does have a set of unique options when look at target is enabled. Look at target, determines whether the camera adjusts its pitch or yaw to frame the target player. Look at offset distance, positions the camera view forward or backward from the look at target, instead of centered. Look at offset horizontal and vertical, position the camera view left or right and upward or downward from the look at target. Pitch and yaw acceleration, determines the speed at which the camera moves leftward or rightward and upward or downward respectively in order to frame the target. Pitch and U max speed controls the max speed in which the camera moves along the U and or pitch. Clamp, if enabled, limits for how far the camera can move in the pitch and U. Clamp min and max values determine the minimum and maximum distance the camera can rotate downward, upwards, leftwards, and rightwards the target. Dead zone, when dead zone is enabled, it establishes an area within which the target can move without affecting the camera. When the target reaches the edge of the dead zone, the camera will move to follow the target.